Hi, so I'm Katherine Olson, and I'm a software engineer at OpenAI. We are a nonprofit research group that is not only working to advance the state of the art in machine learning, but also to do that in a way that benefits all of humanity as widely and evenly as possible. So we recently released the, a, a open source release of this project, Universe, so I'm gonna talk to you, one, about what Universe is and how you might use it, but two, a really important lesson that came up for us, which is that it's hard to optimize for the right thing. So I want you to carry that with you away from this talk. So first, what is Universe? Um, it's a collection of diverse environments for reinforcement learning. So unlike a static data set where you might have like images with labels, this is a set of environments where active agents observe a world like a game or some sort of form to fill out online and then take actions in this dynamic evolving environment. And so the important piece that we've added with Universe is a unified interface and made it easy to add new environments. So takeaway one I have for you is that if you're solving a problem that could be phrased as taking actions in a dynamic evolving environment where a static data set won't cut it, consider implementing that as a universe environment um, and feel free to reach out for me, to me if you want help sort of getting that set up. Um, and takeaway two is something we discovered when we were fleshing out the first few hundred environments to add to universe is we thought, okay, well, we'll put in these flash games and we'll have the agent optimize for getting points. And then we discovered that getting points in the game doesn't always correspond to things that we think of as what we wanted. You know, you want the agent to complete the race quickly, but it might complete the race as slowly as possible, getting the same number of points, or it might spin in a circle, knocking over obstacles that get it a lot of points. And I think this is an important takeaway in the real world. Uh, and like I said, part of OpenAI's goal is to build things that benefit humanity. And so all of us here in this room, practitioners, we're all working on projects where we're optimizing something. That's what makes it an AI or a machine learning project is involves optimization. And if you're not optimizing for the right thing, like let's say you're building a social media site uh, and you're optimizing for likes, clicks, and shares, and you discover that you've built something where you're entrapping everyone's attention to like, click, and share on this site, things that they don't find very fulfilling. And so you ask yourself, like, is that really what I wanted? Wasn't I trying to enrich people's lives or, or bring some sort of meaning to the world? Um, so I think the sorts of problems that we've been finding, even just trying to get little bots to play little games, have shown us that the hard part of reinforcement learning is no longer developing the environments, we've sort of got that down, but making sure that the thing we're optimizing for is the right thing to optimize for. So what I want from this community is a group of people who are thinking about what's good to optimize. Thank you.